Now this is the new Nanolera Carrera S. I know you probably can't really hear me too good because the young lady is actually speaking, but I do want to talk real quick. Now, Lincoln and Cadillac have both uh, entered new SUV segments into their lineups, and here I'm looking at the new Cadillac, and it is nice, man. This thing is nice. The new XT6. Now, those passengers in that second and the third row, they're going to have their own USB ports. They will have storage for smartphones as well as the water bottles there. And up top, air vents with directional control. So everyone's gonna stay very comfortable. Now, now, this is my first time seeing this thing, so cargo, I'm uh, actually viewing it with you guys right now live. Row and the remote folding second row seats. When those are folded flat, it really is a flat load level storage floor. You're gonna have generous amounts of cargo space. And let's not forget, this so it's bigger the than the previous generation XLR as well as the sport and it looks more like okay it's so about the size of the city, first generation XLR or not XLR you're going to have one touch smartphone SUV carry, I can't the remember the name I got one of the damn things y'all know what damn car like truck I got this has intuitive job functionality which allows you to interact with your system it works kind of like a joystick Eyes on the road, hands on the wheel, but it's very easy to Looks nice, uh, interact like with it. your Cadillac user experience with that new uh, rotary controller. We also have the uh, USB ports in all three rows. There's going to be wireless cell phone charging in the center armrest there. Drop in the comments, let me know what y'all think. Now y'all know I can't come to the Cadillac booth without showing y'all a V. Look at this hot rod. What up, brother? Oh, you just text me. I'm filming a uh, YouTube vlog. I'm sorry. What's going on, big bro? Yeah, I'm here now. I'm filming. Yep. <laughs> Okay. Now I showed you guys the all new Cadillac truck SUV that they entered into the SUV market. Now I'm at the Lincoln version. All new Lincoln Aviator. Now it's comparable size. The interior is crazy, like crazy, crazy. I can't wait to see if I can get inside one of them and show you guys the inside. But I like the wheels. It's the Black Label Edition.
dope. I don't know, Cadillac. I think they're giving y'all some smoke. All right, guys. So this Cadillac was definitely dope, man. But I gotta show you this Porsche. Ah, now this is actually a vehicle you can actually get. It's called a Panamera GTS Sports Turismo. Yeah, it's a wagon. That thing is dope. I don't know, man. I like it. Alcantara. I actually like this better than that one crazy right but i do looks sweet i like this whole rear looks you know bulged out and everything it's dope now this is the new 9 alera carrera s all new styling sweet Big, huge Brumbos. Now they got staggered wheels, front and rear. I like the styling. Not much off as far as the exterior from the previous generation, but it is some subtle changes. Looks good. I like it. Classic Porsche design. It looks like the rims in the front are actually a smaller diameter, diameter than the rear. And on this one, this whole rear tail light lights up red. I like that. Looks cool. I don't know how I feel about the grates on top. Kind of looks kind of awkward. But uh, yeah, here it is in another color. Interior. The wood is crazy. It's got 21s in the rear and 20s in the front. So yeah, it has a one inch larger di diameter uh, rear rim than it does in the front. I like that Porsche. Do something different. What do you guys think about the new Porsche? P -p -p Play dead, made that.